All right, Todd's here. <laughs> Let's we'll talk about the weather. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. I mean, that, that'll that make you feel good, right? The weather will make Finally. you feel good. And everybody's Finally. in a good mood. Kids are happy. Like, you know, know, you don't have to argue about whether or not you can wear shorts to school right now. It's like, yes, you can. Right. Yeah. As opposed to like February when you know, <laughs> the kids <laughs> when are they're they're still trying to wear shorts. Yeah. And then they still did. And, and they did. I, I yeah. lost that argument then, well, but at least I feel better about losing now. Right. So. It's, you, you, pick, <laughs> you pick and choose your battles. Like, I mean, that's one that I do pick with them. I'm not letting them wear shorts in the middle of the winter, but some do because they've got to pick other fights with, with the kids. Too so. many to choose from. Yeah, too many, right? <laughs> All right, let's check out some of the warmest temperatures we've had so far this year. And in Portland, the highest temperature that we've recorded is 79. That was last month, April 14th. That was right before school vacation week. That was a Friday before it. Augusta on that same day cleared 80, hit 83. And Bangor's warmest temp, 77. Just a few days ago, that was on May 6th, the average first 80-degree day in Portland is not too far from where we are right now, May 14th. It's already happened in Augusta, so this was premature by about a month. And in Bangor, the average first 80 is May 20th, and it might happen today. We're going to be real close. We're starting out mild. There's no frost out there in most spots, but there could be a touch in Holton, Berlin, New Hampshire. Some of those mountain valleys may have a little bit but 52 in Bangor, 51 degrees in Portland, Lewiston's 49 right now. We're on the warmer side of this front right here. What the satellite isn't able to see is wildfire smoke. There are still those Canadian fires out west that are burning, jet stream winds transporting that over the northeast. And there's going to be a milky appearance to the sky at times, especially in the mornings and evenings. You'll notice it with the sun. It's got this bright red and orange tint to it. Looks really cool, but it does filter out sunshine a little bit. So we'll have a smoky sun this morning. Quiet out there. No frost. Very comfortable for you early on this morning. Lots of sunshine for the middle of the day. We get an offshore land breeze this time of the year. If you get a sea breeze, you're done. Mid coast down east, you warm up with the rest of us because of that land breeze hitting the 70s. Watch southern Maine here. You're going to see a few little blips of green. There's a very small chance for a brief shower. Wouldn't last long, like five minutes, and then right behind it, the sun comes back out. Don't count on it. It's unlikely, but your town might get a quick, quick little downpour, and then that's it, and it's back to sunshine this evening, and it stays warm through sunset because of that breeze offshore. There are the temps, 75 to 80. I was a little gun shy little bit to put 80 on the map in Portland and in Bangor. So it's probably going to stay elusive, at least for now. But it hits 80 in southern parts of York County, like the Berwicks and Elliott, and then over the border into Rochester, New Hampshire, and down into the seacoast. Here's that front for tomorrow afternoon, isolated to scattered shower or rumble of thunder. If we do get thunder, by the way, it's sub-severe, no big wind, no hail with it. Just a couple of rumbles here and there clearing out over the weekend. This builds in for Sunday. So does some cooler air, but that retreats on Monday. We're back above 70 on Monday and then we're plotting this front, which could lead to some unsettled times middle of next week with scattered showers and chilly temps. Partly sunny on Saturday, still warm. So this is the cloudier day, but the warmer one. And then on Sunday, Mother's Day, nearly perfect. Mostly sunny with a temp right around 65. Marine forecast, west-southwest winds, one to three footers, water temp close to 50 now. Mostly sunny skies outside of that smoke that's up there, 75 to 80, super warm. Tomorrow, mid-70s with a chance for a shower or storm in the afternoon or evening. And then on Saturday, it's drying out, a mix of sun and clouds, low to mid-70s, mid-60s on Sunday, mostly sunny. Monday looks good, and then Tuesday, that front gets into the picture, and it's probably slow to move through. So we'll start to see the chance for showers Tuesday afternoon, lingering into Wednesday as well. Okay. But great weekend. Overall, really good. Yeah, Mother's Day looks great too. So mm -hmm. get outside or take your take all, mom someplace. All are happy. All are happy. <laughs> good stuff. <laughs>